Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, make sure to subscribe for more K-pop audition tips and information like this. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing an audition tutorial for Pledis new audition, and this is their online audition. So yeah, if this doesn't interest you, I do have a whole playlist with other audition tutorials, so make sure to go check those out. And if you want me to do an audition tutorial for one that I have not done yet, you can recommend videos on Patreon. And let's get on with the video! Okay guys, so right now we are on the Pledis Audition Instagram and we're just going to go on to the email audition one right here. And this one is a pretty simple procedure, but they uploaded it on June 9th and it was fairly recent, so I decided to make an audition tutorial video about it. So the application period is ongoing, so please don't ask me, so when does this end? It's just ongoing, so until they release, oh this is over, they are going to accept applicants. And you have to be at least after 2003, so if you were born in 2003, that also counts. And it doesn't matter what your gender is, what your nationality is, and things like that. They really don't put a restriction on that. And the categories that you can audition with is vocal, rap, dance, acting and modeling. So how you audition is first you need to include a face shot of your face <laughs> and then your entire body and then also do whatever you chose. So if you did dancing then you're gonna film a dance video. And so vocal and rap are combined in a way that if you want to do vo both vocal and rap it also counts. Like say if a song has both vocal and rap then you can do that but if you just want to do vocal if you just want to do rap that also counts as well and also include your name your birthday your nationality your height your weight your school where they can contact you so this could be email or your phone number your sns id so sns means social media this could be your instagram handle your facebook handle whatever and other information that you would like to add but there's really nothing special that you need to do for that and number three add all of those and email it to this email address. So they'll email whoever passed the first round and they do have the rights to your videos, but they won't use it for any other, any other things. So just the audition and they won't share it to anyone as well. So let's go read the summer box one. So this audition looks for anyone who looks like either Pledis artists or has similar talents. So this audition is open until July 11th and anyone born after 2002. So if you were born in 2002, that also counts. And you can recommend yourself or recommend your friend. So I'm assuming you're just going to be recommending yourself. So go to the QR code and kind of like take a picture with that. I have an Apple phone. I don't know how it works for other phones. So if you just tap on it, it leads you to the website, which I copy and pasted here, but we're going to be talking about that a little bit later. And I know people will ask how to do this, so I'm just going to do a demonstration. You just put your phone and your phone will recognize the website. So you just tap that and it'll lead you to the neighbor website or the naval neighbor form. It takes a while to download, so like wait and then that is how you access it. And whoever gets accepted will get Pledis training, obviously. And your personal information won't be shared except for the like the judging process. They will contact the people who pass, but they won't contact the people that don't pass. Pretty simple. So this is in Korean, so I'm going to have to translate this again. Let's see. So whoever you want to recommend, you can put your name here. So you can put down your name here. That, that works too. Your gender, so it's girl, boy. And then when you were born. And then you also need the person you recommended email or phone number their Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, whatever, putting the link of it, and also their school, and also the reason why you want to recommend them. So recommend them, this could also be why you want to recommend yourself. So you could just write a short description about yourself and how you connect to a Pledis, you know, just an artist. This could be from a group, this could be a soloist, it doesn't matter. However, I would try to avoid the people that left Pledis already, so like a lot of Preston members, they left Pledis, so it's best kind of to avoid that and try to be as unique as possible. If you chose maybe Uchi from Seventeen, I feel like a lot of people would choose him because he's already popular, so maybe go for more of like the unknown uh, maybe like artists, but obviously you do have to have a connection with them. Either you look like them, you rap like them, you dance like them, you do have to have that because it is the point of this audition. They also want you to include a picture. So this could be any picture that shows your face well. So this could be a passport picture, any sort of daily pictures count too. So this is a little bit more casual compared to auditions like you know just the normal online auditions. They don't necessarily have to be like straight faced and like very 
form fitting. They can be like casual too, and don't use don't use you know filters and apps and things like that as always. What I also wanted to mention in this part is that if you chose visual, like I look like this person from Pledis, then you want to make sure that the picture that you actually chose looks like that artist. You don't want to choose a random picture that you look good in, but another random picture that you look good in, but also look like this member or this artist. So make sure you have that in mind. Don't like include the picture of the artist themselves. That's not really what they want you to see from this. So yeah. And also put in your information if you are recommending, oof, Grammarly, okay. If you are recommending someone else, put in your information as well. But if you're just recommending yourself, you don't need to do this. My computer is exploding right now. That's what the background sound is. But you just agree to this. So it just means that they won't use your information for anything else than the audition itself. And then you say yes, you choose yes, and then you can submit it. And I also thought of a few questions that you guys might have about this. So the first question is, can you do both at the same time? So both the online audition and the summer box audition. And the answer to that is yes. There are two different auditions and they never said that you can't really do that and it doesn't matter too much. So yes, you can do it at the same time. And the next question is like, is there a possibility that they can see you as spam because you auditioned twice? So if you audition for like, say the online one three times because you just didn't like the way you submitted it, I don't know, then that is definitely spam. But if you did the two auditions once each, then that's totally fine. It's actually why they're open for you because they want you to audition. But if you do the same one, like more than two times, what's the point? They aren't looking for that. They'll see you as spam most definitely. And the last question that I have is, why is there no English translation? Does this mean that they aren't looking for international people? So I mentioned this in the clips before, but they both accept international people they don't care about, the age, the gender, or the nationality. So it does not matter if you are Korean or not. I think they just kind of were lazy and didn't take the extra step to add an English translation. So sometimes it happens, you can't expect companies to be perfect. That is my belief. And yes, that are that is pretty much all the questions that are that is all the questions that I have. So those are the two Pledis auditions open. I hope this helps. So as I said, for more auditions, check out my audition tutorials playlist. Make sure to comment down this emoji if you made it until here. Random question, but does anyone have like emoji suggestions? I'm quickly running out of them. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.